Jackson, Reverend Sean David Coleman at South Park Missionary Baptist Church, 82nd year anniversary. Don't touch that dial, Can TV, Channel 36, on RCN, Wow, Comcast, and on Channel 99 on AT&T. South Park Missionary Baptist Church, 82nd year anniversary. Channel 36, don't touch that dial, join the program, already in progress, amen.
birds. In this afternoon's text, we find Jesus one chapter into his infamous sermon on the mount, where he is encouraging all God's children initially in chapter 5 by the Beatitudes, and letting us know that despite life's challenges, we are blessed. Then, towards the last part of chapter 6, Jesus gives the analogy of the found of the earth. He's assuring those that were hearing then and those that are hearing now that God, if God loves the bird, certainly God will love you. If God takes care of those dumb animals that we call dumb animals, certainly God will take care of his creation. Uh, certainly God will provide you everything that you need. We're here today and we shout with Jesus' joke. Because for 82 years, the Lord has made a way somehow. When beneath the cross we bow, there's a sweet relief in knowing that the Lord will make a way somehow. Am I talking to anybody here today that knows that God will work it out? So the assurance that Jesus gives to us today that God can love the world. Certainly God will love you. And for 82 years, God has loved those that have come into this house. Gathered in his name to worship him. God loves the bird. Because God loves the bird, I would for a few moments. Did you, in your mind's eye, go with me to a place called bird? Missionary Baptist Church. Just to see how much God loves the bird. As you step in the bird missionary Baptist church on a Sunday morning, you'll realize that God loves the evil. God gives the evil greater strength than any bird in his creation. See, I'm Franklin once came the antidote that the evil was just like God. For evil can see through the storm, find his way to his destination. God loves the evil, and the evil's like God. But God can see through your storm and see his way through your destination. Our God loves the evil. But the evil is fast. The evil can mount up on his wings and get right where he needs to go, right in the nick of time. But the evil is my God. But just when you need him most, he flies through the storm and the rain. And he may not come, as my grandmother used to say, when you're wrong. But he'll be there right on the time. So the evil is like God. Evil is like God for his strong. There's legends of the evil being able to fly high above the clouds. And in the moment's time, sweep down and pick up the baby and carry the baby off into the sunset. Like God. And that no matter what your troubles are, he sits high and looks low. Whatever your burdens are, no matter how heavy they may be, he'll swoop down in the nick of time and take your burdens to the Lord and leave them there. Is there anybody here who knows what it's like for God to carry your burdens in the sunset? I am a bird missionary in Baptist Church. The most of the evil is like God because he cares for his young. On the eaglets I am their nest. He gives the eaglets some tough love. In order for them to learn to fly, they sit around long enough, he pushes them out of the nest. He pushes them out, they begin to flap their wings frantically. And then they begin to try as hard as they can to fly like their parents fly. But the eagle, despite his tough love, loves his children. Right before those that don't have the capacity 
on the side of the road. So the man, missionary man, the church, God loves. The evil. And I stopped that here today with great joy. Because I'm mad that God doesn't want to love evil. I'm mad to love the chicken too.
love you. He loves him. He gives him everything that they need. But on Sunday morning, now I'm almost through today. On Sunday morning, there is yet another word.
Alpha. A constant friend is he. His eye has been on this place. His eye has been on this pastor right there. His eye has been on this side of the pastor. His eye has been on the deacon board. And you ought to know he watches over you. May God's peace be with you until we 